Mr. Ross, but you understand with all, he's in many countries, the Trump organizations all over the world, and this could raise some real conflicts for you in terms of doing your job. Will you commit that you will notify this committee if another country offers incentives or threatens consequences to the Trump family or Trump organization assets in the course of your international trade negotiations and efforts to promote exports? Well, any, anything that interferes with my job is something that I will have very little tolerance for if I'm confirmed. That I can assure you of. And will you commit to report to this committee? It's kind of a yes or no answer. If, if another country offers incentives or threatens consequences to the Trump family or the Trump organization assets in the course of doing your job and working on trade. Well, certainly if they threaten me, I would be able to make people aware of it. But if, if the hypothetical that you're posing might very well be something I'm not even aware of. So that would make it very difficult to inform anyone of anything. Well, I, I'm talking about if, if in the course of doing your job and working on right. trade negotiations, somebody comes to you with either a threat or incentive that involves the Trump organization, would you let us at this committee know that that was happening? Well, I'll tell you two things. I know the president-elect quite well. And I think people who threaten him or offer inappropriate things will find he doesn't take that very lightly. There will be a very strong response on his part, quite independently of anything I would do. Well, I'm, I'm urging you to try to let us know if that situation comes up, because I think it's very important in terms of the objectives of your, your department to make sure we keep those conflicts out.